If you're a business owner who creates websites for their clients and is looking for a website builder that you can have under your brand, then Doric is the website builder for you. You can create websites without any code. You can have unlimited bandwidth, storage, and premium templates and blocks with the agency plan. You can have membership paywalls and remove the branding of Doric and have your brand under it. So let's see how the agency plan works with Doric. The agency has additional stuff that they can access which their clients can't, like the settings option. Now under the settings option, you can change the name of the site, you can delete the site, you can change some SEO settings like accessing the sitemap, give it a robot's text, you can add redirect URLs, and then you have agency site configuration. You can set the amount of team members that your client can invite. You can also set the amount of users or members that your client can have. You can also set a chat service provider from platforms like HubSpot, Chris, Gist, etc. Now, if you're wondering how your clients are going to get customer service, well, they're not going to get customer service from Doric. You will. Like, for example, if you go here, you can chat with our support team. You can provide customer support for your clients if you integrate a chat service provider. Now, let me show you what the site looks like for your client. Now, if you want to bring your client to your site, invite them, simply go to team members and invite a member. Give their email, give their name, and give them a role. Now, these are the default roles. You can always set custom roles for your clients. Now in this default roles, the role with the highest amount of permissions is administrator. You can get more details about this on our documentation and I will set the link to this documentation in the description below. Now send them an invite and the invitation is sent. Now let me show you what this mail looks like on your client side. Now this is the mail that your client will receive. They will be seeing that they have been invited to join this website. Now if they click on this button, they will be redirected to the dashboard. If this link doesn't work, they can always use this. Okay, so this link will expire in 48 hours, just a reminder. Now let me show you what it looks like from the client's end. Let's copy this link. This is just for testing, you can do it yourself. Let's go to an incognito window, let's paste this link and you can see a dashboard. And this is exactly the type of dashboard that your client will see. Now let's explore the differences between these dashboards. Oh wow, there's no settings option here. Your client, even with the highest amount of permissions, which is the administrator role, they won't be able to see the settings, which you can, of course. Another major difference that your client won't be able to see is Doric's name anywhere. Since Doric is a white label website builder and you'll be able to brand it under your agency name, you can give your agency's logo over here and they will be seeing the logout button here. If which they click, they'll be taken to a logout screen where your dashboard will have the go to Doric app button. Here you can see the go to Doric app button, which if you click, you'll be able to see the sites that you have created for your clients. Now you may raise this question that Hey, how does my client log into their site? Well, it's simple. They just write their domain name and they simply write slash dashboard beside their domain. Now note this down if you want to tell your clients on how they can log into their site. So let's test this out. Let's copy this link and let's see this from the client site's window. Let's log out of this website and you can see the URL. Let's paste that URL. Since it's already logged out, I'll be taken to the login screen. This is the client's end. Now if they simply put their email here and they press send magic link, the magic link will be sent to their email. Let's see what that email looks like. This is what the email looks like and you can see sign into this website. So if they press sign in now, they will be automatically signed in to their site. Let's test it out. There you go, I pasted that link and here I am. This is the name that I had assigned to my team member. Remember, Abrar, and yeah, so this is your client's name. And they will be able to do the same. They can log out, not log in. So this domain slash dashboard, this is how they log into their site. Now here's some additional stuff that an agency owner can access. Like you can bill your clients directly from your dashboard. You can send them a billing request. I'll make another video on client billing later, but for now this is just about how the agency sites work. Another thing that an agency can do is, like I said, they can set a chat provider. I will create another video on how they can do that. That's very easy, but I'll show you guys uh, on a later video.